Hi friends, welcome to biologyexamsorry.com. In this video, we are going to discuss about independent, dependent and controlled variable in an experiment. What's the difference between all these terms? So we have taken a simple experiment that we have used in all our previous research methodology videos, effect of biofertilizer X on plant growth. Let's start with the definition. Variable is a factor, trait or condition that are changing in an experiment it can have different values. In an experiment there are three types of variables. First is the independent variable, the variable that the researcher changes. Second is the dependent variable, the variable that is affected by the change in the independent variable. And the third one is a control variable. It is a variable that is kept constant throughout the experiment. Let's take that example to explain the concept. Effect of biofertilizer X on plant growth. A researcher has developed a formulation of biofertilizer and he is testing the effect of that biofertilizer on plant growth. Therefore, independent variable according to the definition, it is a variable that the researcher changes. Therefore, in this experiment, it is the application of biofertilizer X. It is the independent variable. Whereas the dependent variable is a variable that is affected by the change in the independent variable. The researcher thinks that the change in this independent variable will cause change in some of the variable which is called as the dependent variable. Here the dependent variable are plant growth, number of leaves, number of fruits, stem length, etc. So researcher thinks that application of biofertilizer X will have some positive effect on dependent variable. Other differences are independent variable is usually denoted by X. It is a cause that is causing the change. The value of independent variable are manipulated by the researcher. Whereas dependent variable is denoted by Y. It is the effect or outcome or the result of the experiment. The values of dependent variable are observed and measured by the researcher in an experiment. And the third type of variable is a control variable. The variables that are held constant throughout the experiment are called as a control variables. Apart from the biofertilizer, there are many other parameters that is required for the plant growth like amount of water, amount of other fertilizers if needed, amount of sunlight, etc. All these things, all these parameters, all these variables should be kept constant. Such variables are called as a controlled variable. It should be in the same value or same amount to all the treatment and the control groups. Then only we could assess the effect of biofertilizer exactly on the plant growth. That's it and let's have a quick summary variable is a factor or a condition that is changing in an experiment it can have different values there are three types of variables first is the independent variable that the researcher manipulates in an experiment then the dependent variable is a variable that is affected by the manipulation of the independent variable the third one is a control variable all other variable that is kept constant in all the treatment and control group throughout the experiment is called the control variable you are with biologyexamsforay.com thank you so much for watching Thank mm -hmm. you.